I would be remiss if I didn't mention, and it's important to remember amidst the chaos of a triple threat match, that victory can be achieved in many different ways, and that it's every man for himself. There's the mat slam with some attitude. Oh my god, a DDT! Lights out. Rolling elbow right on the mark. Backdrop suplex. Here we go, back inside the ring. I wonder if John Cena knew his career would change forever when he put on a rapper costume for SmackDown's Halloween party in 2002. But he showed he can sp He's got the shoulders down. I can't believe it. He just kicked out. You have to put in a little more work than that. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Bulldog. Byron brought up Cena's study of thugonomics. Even though he had early success showing ruthless aggression, Cena had hit a rough patch and was in real danger of getting lost in the fold before he discovered his affinity for rap. In the years that followed, Cena very effectively used his impressive rhymes to rile up enemies, ascend to the main event, and win championships. He gets it with a reversal. Incredible striking cover. Some superstars who have competed in a triple threat match feel it's a good idea to have both a finishing move that brings you to a pinfall attempt on your opponent and a submission move that can make your opponent tap out. Given the chaotic and unpredictable nature of a triple threat, that sounds like a good plan to me. Byron, before you mention the strategy some superstars have implemented for competing in a triple threat match, and that includes having a finishing maneuver to put someone away for the 1-2-3 and a submission to make them tap out. There are many superstars in WWE who can do just that, which makes them even more dangerous to opponents. The way I look at it is you can never have enough weapons at your disposal, especially in something like a triple threat match. If a... He's looking at it. You gotta believe this one's over. Got every ounce of that one. This could be over. A bad place to be for the challenger. We're Ouch. all gonna find out what he's made of here in this triple threat match. Given what he's gone through in his match so far, I wouldn't be surprised to see one of these guys oh, pluck man. him off here. In a back and forth match like this, he has to do everything in his power not to let his opponent gain too much momentum here. Uh-oh, here we go, here we go! I don't know, is that enough to stop Cena? Hooked up. Ah, oh, shit breaker. I'll tell you, watching Extreme Rules matches make me happy. My end like days are behind me. You talk about a treacherous environment to compete in. Oh, shows no mercy. And that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Long way up in the electric chair. What a driver. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. Oh, man, that's put so many competitors away. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts. And he's heading back in. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. If you ask me, guys, matches like this where there are essentially no rules are one giant free-for-all where absolutely anything can happen. Oh, 
Oh, he's so ruthless. Now that's how you use a table to your advantage. Oh, boy, he is rolling. I don't know, is that enough to stop Cena? Well, John Cena's in a real bad spot. I like the way you describe this match, Byron. It's one giant free-for-all. And while it's exciting to watch, it's absolute torture on these superstars. It is, Cole. And unfortunately, matches like this usually result in injury. Sometimes serious injury. When this guy's on, look out. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. The superstar always needs to be ready to be attacked by both opponents in a triple threat match. Circumstances create interesting alliances, and the numbers game can become your worst enemy in a hurry when you're competing against two other opponents. No matter how you look at it, it's a situation you don't want to be in, but you must prepare for it. Nope, reverses it. I'd have to agree with what Byron's saying. When you've got action taking place all over the arena, complete with every weapon imaginable, it's not easy to keep up. Well, I'll try, Cole. That's what you're getting paid for, isn't it? Here he goes. Power bomb! Just when you thought we were going to crown a new champion. Got the shoulders down. And an ear fall. Yeah, it's going to take more than that. In matches like this, guys, you learn very quickly which superstars have what it takes to truly get extreme. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts. Looks to me, guys, like the champ has no plans on losing the title anytime soon. Regarding Corey's point about superstars having what it takes to get extreme, I would argue that every superstar in the locker room possesses a mean streak. Yeah, but not all mean streaks are created equal, Michael. But I'd say there's only a select few who can turn their mean streaks all the way up to the most extreme level. Of course, Extreme Rules matches have resulted in some gruesome moments over the years, and perhaps none was more gruesome than in... Ooh, John Cena may have it. Ooh, what impact. What a comeback. Not where he wants to be right now. Hey, he got himself into this mess. Well, he's got to get himself out of it now. He wants no part of the outside. Oh, man, what a boot. This is a grueling championship match. Nobody wants to lose this opportunity. Look out! Oh boy, he is rolling. He looks for it once again. Oh! I don't know, is that enough to stop Cena? John Cena with a nice reversal. This is the Cena that's just about unstoppable. Uh-oh. This is not going to end well. Not at all. Slam with authority. That has got to be it. Now that got those shoulders on the mat. Well, that was a close call. He's still in this. There's got to be some point in the match where those thoughts start to creep in that it could be over. And then you got to dig down deep, get rid of the self-doubt, and continue on toward victory.
Keep in mind, this superstar is competing hurt tonight. Or so we're told. I'm not so sure I believe it. What a brutal beating we've seen dished out so far here tonight. Oh boy, he is rolling. He's looking at nailed it. Oh no, is that enough to stop Cena? Uh-oh, double underhook. This is gonna be nasty. Oh, oh driver! Spiked him. I don't know, is that enough to stop Cena? The champion into the cover! John Cena the has been and eliminated. The victory. And here's another look at some incredible action from a match that we're not likely to stop talking about for a long, long time. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic. Gonna feel the effects of this win for a while. Few things are more rewarding than that feeling of keeping your opponent's shoulders down for the three count. Boy, I don't think we're going to have too many disappointed viewers at home. Not with action like we just saw.